What's up guys, my name is Joe and in today's video I'm gonna talk about a unique thing that is happening in the tech industry right now, which is Apple has poor sales and Samsung is making less money because of that. What? How does, how does this work? What, what's happening? Before I continue, today's video was sponsored by AppleRider.com. If you like Apple products or just like hearing and reading Apple news constantly on a daily basis, be sure to check out their website. And also while you're there, you can buy and sell used Apple stuff. It's the perfect place. Read about it, buy it, if you don't like it, sell it, get money, make money, you know, whatever works. AppleRider.com. Okay, so iPhone 10, not as popular as Apple would have hoped. They're, I mean, they're doing fantastic, but still. Now the thing is that um, since they are not selling as much iPhones as they predicted back at the end of 2017, um, what they did before they had their prediction is they upped their quota for OLED screens. And we know that Samsung is making OLED screens for Apple. So that means Samsung had allocated a lot of um, manpower and uh, everything to creating, building these OLED screens for Apple. But since the demand is not so big, Apple had to reduce the amount of OLED screens they ordered. So that means Samsung just lost 50 or 60% of their production. So those OLED screens that they had to create or have to create have to be sold to some other manufacturers. Now, Apple's not making enough iPhones. Samsung allocated a lot of um, production power to those iPhones. Not happening, they can't sell, they're making less money. That's business, that's business for you. They freaking rely on each other. It's very interesting to see that for Samsung to make a lot of money, they are hoping Apple succeeds with their iPhone as they're the biggest um, suppliers for the, the for iPhone screens. I don't know if Apple will be switching from another for another manufacturer other than Samsung, but um, since they are moving forward with OLED screens and OLED screens might be getting cheaper because currently Samsung is building an OLED screen for $100 per unit for Apple. That's two times as expensive as an LCD screen as LCD screens cost around $50. This is one of the reasons why the iPhone 10 is so expensive because all the components with Face ID and screens and blah, 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 yeah, 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 are more expensive so they're making less money on it if they would've kept it on the same price as like an iPhone 8. So as we progress forward in time, these components will be getting cheaper. Apple will be ordering a lot more because we're hearing that we're gonna have a bigger OLED screen. Uh, we're also gonna get an LCD screen. I don't know if uh, Samsung is gonna make those or not, but at the current state, Samsung losing money because iPhone sales are not going. And that's, that's how it is. Guys, thank you very much for watching. Until the next video, stay safe. Be sure to hit subscribe and click on the notifications to be part of my notification squad. Thank you very much for watching. Stay safe and hang loose.